seventh birthday party, I really took it upon myself to go all out with the decorating and planning. I had never planned a children's birthday party before, or actually maybe never planned a birthday party in general before. So I was super excited to be able to do this and give him the best day possible for his seventh birthday. Most of the decorations that you see on this table and in the room are from Amazon, but everything that's not from Amazon came from Five Below. I just went there the day before and like loaded up on Easter basket stuff and birthday stuff all in one. Lyric doesn't just like one thing or have like one solid favorite thing. He likes Star Wars, he likes Marvel, he likes Minecraft, he loves Juice World. so I tried to mix all of that and just give him a little bit of everything that he loves. I had the topper for his cake and the cupcakes made out of fondant icing. I had went and bought like a ton of chalk and bubbles and silly string and stuff for the kids to play with at his party. So I set the chalk out to make it obvious that it was for them to use and then I couldn't help but draw a little bit myself. He originally had said that he wanted to have his birthday party at Chuck E. Cheese or a local place called The Factory that we have here in Gadsden, but with COVID restrictions, it's really hard to plan a party somewhere like that. Everyone would be required to wear masks and we would be limited on how many people could be there. So we decided it would be a better bet to go with just like a bouncy house and it actually worked out really well because we had just signed paperwork and finished the purchase of this piece of property. So we were able to use that for the bouncy house. It's right next door to our house. And then I ended up finding like some little activities from Five Below too that I just sprinkled in, like a little rocket launcher and one of those little parachute things that you used to play with in PE, if y'all remember those. Happy birthday! <laughs> Go check it out. That's cool, huh? Did you see the cupcakes? <laughs> oh my god, it's tons of pizza. Is that and it is, it's made out of sugar. And then these are cakes and masks for everybody. <laughs> Some straws and little gift bags. And we got some stuff outside too. Just uh, little light up bracelets and straws and stuff. <laughs> I think his face, he likes it. <laughs> I think so too. <laughs> and then um, out what front. Is this? Oh, you know what that is. Does it not make noise? <laughs> That's disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> definitely safe to say that this party was a great success. I think all of the kids had a really good time together. I think the adults loved having an excuse to be able to all get together and catch up after being on lockdown for so long. And I think that Clever and I just really enjoy being able to host at our house for the first time. 
and that all around it was just one for the books. So make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.